Hey guys, Tuckster23 here, and today I'll be opening a package I ordered from Zephyr Epic, I think they're called, I can't quite remember, but um, if you, as you saw, there's a tin in the background, new tin, um, if you guys, actually, I'll move the camera slightly, if you guys want to, I'm hoping I posted that beforehand, but I never know, because I just kind of schedule them and put them away, but I ordered a package from Zephyr Epic, and first of all, while I went to grab the tin from um, my local Walmart that just restocked, um, I picked up a fat pack of a Upper Deck 2021-2020-21 Hockey Series 2. I have not opened, I have not opened 2021 at all. Here's the odds for you guys. Very low chance of getting, I think the highest chance we've got is a UD Portraits rookie, but really, really hoping for that, um, young guy. Nope. Uh, doesn't look like we've got a thick card in here. Uh, I got my sister to try to pick which one was the heaviest while we were there, and maybe she pulled me a young gun. I'm not going to force this, we're going to, yeah, we're going to do that, try to get these, just in case I get something good. We got a beeping thing, I think, yep, we got a beeping thing, so sometimes I heard from some people that that's a sign of something good in the pack, but um, here's my first look at the series two. So we start off with a Sam Steele, Arturi Lekkonen, Brett Conley, Alexander Nylander, Nick Schmaltz, Logan Couture, Cody Glass, Mark Giordano, Michael Campney. Ilya Mikheyev, Max Pacioretty, Jason Spezza, okay, well, it's not really anything. Gilly Sen, an OPG marquee rookie. So, not the greatest, but um, insert nonetheless. We got a Nikita Kucherov, Connor Halbuck, Patrick Marlowe, I think he passed Cody Howell for most, most games played, Oscar Lindblom, Tyler Bertuzzi, Travis Dermott, Pekka Rene, Dante Fabro, Jonas Corpusello, Nico Heeshear, Madison Bowie, Alexander Burkowski, and Freddie Anderson. So, not too bad of a, well, not great at all, but it did, it did get Gilly Sen, so obviously the beeping thing was not not a success, but here now to show you guys what the package I ordered. So, I got this while the supplies still lasted, and it is, as you saw, it's a cheap buy, but I purchased myself a retail box of 2021 um, uh, Series 2. Uh, I was thinking of giving this away, to, or not giving it away, but maybe selling it. But I know flagships don't sell for too much more than you buy it for. So I just decided I, just decided I was just going to rip it for you guys. I think it's like guaranteed like six young guns, or yeah, six or so young guns. Um, yeah, I'm not not quite sure, but let's get right into it. You guys can please leave a like on the video, please comment your favorite card in the set, you're going to look for that Caprizov, that um, Stutzla, um, I'm not a fan of this rookie class, just because they haven't been, none of them really shined except for Caprizov, and maybe like Jason Robertson. 
I don't think, I don't know if Jason Robertson's in this one. I think he's in the first, first one, or for or series one. But, um, here we go. Try to rip this off as cleanly as possible. There we go. Not sure which side it opens from. Oh, got some. I think that's like the Tops logo on my hand. So, try to open this up. There we go. My first look at the, apart from videos, my first actual look at the Series 2. There we go. Nice and little. There, and we'll uh, comment which pack you think we'll actually get um, a decent young gun in. Um, like I said, we got this Gil Sen, so literally almost anything better than that is going to be a win. So we'll start from the left. Here's the pack odds. Hopefully you guys can see them. Young guns are 1 in 4. The Kamsus are 1 in 8. Dazzlers Green are 1 in 7. Um, OPG Retro Update Rookies is 1 in 15. OPG Update Rookies is 1 in 6. So, I'm hoping for a program of excellence. Those cards are always, always cool, but. Let's get right into it. So we've got a Patty Kane, Ryan Pollock, your high school, and then we start off with a Jamie Ben UD Canvas. We've got a nice Austin Matthews and Elias Pedersen card on as the checklist. A Mike Smith, a Freddie Anderson, and a Drake Batherson. So, first pack, not too bad, got a canvas out of it. Looks like we've got our portraits in this one. Start off with a Anton Strawman, Brady Kachuk, Oliver Ekman Larson, Matthew Corzell, oh, never mind, a Kirill Ustamenko. Yeah, I mis mixed up the purple in the back, but this is our marquee rookie. Last Vladislav Gavrikov, a Anthony Manta, and a Joe Ferry. So let's see. The marquee rookie. Let's look at the odds for the marquee rookie. Try to get out of the frame. So update rookies. Retro update rookies. Award winners. I'm pretty sure what? This would just be a uh, retro, retro rookie, I'm assuming. Um, I can't tell, but I assume just a um, what's it called? Just a OPG retro update rookie. Pretty sure. I don't know. I haven't really looked at the set very much. I watched some videos, not too many. I could also be very wrong on a lot of these OPG things. I kind of hate that it's OPG, but beggars can't be choosers sometimes, so uh, this one opened very well. Okay, let's just. I think it opens up pretty well, but I want to say the cards come out very well. So, looks like we got a Dazzler, got Andre Palat. Jacob Voracek, a Pekka Rene, and Mat Mattis Kivlenix. It's not bad. He also backs up, uh, whatever his name is, so he doesn't get much time to play. But we got a Zach Parisi, Dazzlers, Dennis Giryanov, a Corey Perry, and a Victor Arvidsson. Move on to our fourth pack. Oh, oh, 
Get some scissors in the way. Start for the Anders Nilsson, Mike Hoffman, Clayton Keller, Bobby Fabry, and a Marky Rookie, Stuart Skinner. Got a Jane Schwartz, Chandler Stevenson, and a Jason Spezza. So, not great as so far. We'll play this fifth pack. Has something. Feels, it looks like a canvas. I can't tell. I can't put, I'm trying, as you can tell, I'm keeping my voice a little bit down. It's like 1 or 2 o'clock in the morning. So, got a Chris Kreider, Radic Faxo, Mike, Michael Amado, and a Alec Regula Marky Rookie. Got a Jordan Stahl, Derek Ryan, Michael Kempney, and a Sean Walker. So, please leave a like on this video, comment on the video, and even a subscribe would be incredible. I've seen I've been adding the hashtags in, and people have started to uh, see my video, so that's always been good. I finally reached 600 views on my channel, so a milestone's a milestone, so we take what we can get. So we got Jacob Slavin, Ryan Johnson, Cam Fowler, and a UD part. Portraits, Philip Kurashev. We got a Brad Hunt, Derek Broussard, Jonathan Quick, and a Pavel Vushnevich. Oh, nice. Love, love to see it. Love to see that the pack just does not want to open. Okay. Got a Travis Zajac, Pierre Luc Dubois, Sebastian Aho, and a Marky Rookie Bowen Byram. So, uh, not great that I, I prefer the Bowen Byram Young Gun, but I know OPG doesn't run much for much, but Scott Lawton, Jim Ben. Tyler Johnson and a Dustin Brown. Got the white hoodie or sweater on again. Hoping you'd be good luck. Better luck than the um it did with the tin. Still pulled some good stuff. I guess one of the cards I pulled in there that I thought was a 70 years of tops was actually a um tops double header card, which is like one in eight packs, I think. So not a bad pull. Got a Justin Falk, Kevin LeBlanc, Philip Chateau. Okay, go from the back. Nicholas Yalmerson, Troy Terry, Ryan Zingle, and let's see. Uh, let's see, it was Blue 53. I couldn't tell you who that was. Austin Pugonski. I have never heard of him. Played a one game. Yeah, I've never heard of him. But, um, yeah, that's two out of the six young guns we're gonna get. So hopefully, get something better out of this. So. Uh, hopefully, to get a, maybe even a relic in this. Very low odds, but hoping to get one. Joel Armia, Adam Henrique, Henry Ogiardu, Jack Hughes, and another Bowen Byram UD portrait. So we're slowly making our way around Bowen Byram. Um, seems like this is a Bowen Byram box. Hopefully we get his young gun. That'll be nice. Adam Bogvis, Zemgus Gergensen, and a Roman Yossi. On to our tenth pack, heading into double digits. And let's see what we got here: Nikita Kucherov, Thomas Shabbat, Anton Roussel, and a UD canvas. Alex Ayafalo, a Marcus Sorensen, 
Andrew, Andrew Cup. I almost said called him Andrew Cup. Andrew Cup, Jack Roslovich, and Roslov Halak. And Tony Kudobin, Andre Sveshnikov, and uh, Matthias Brom. Mm, never heard of his name too, but also the Red Wings haven't been great. So, Andrew, Andrew Mashapani, Ilya Mikhaev, Brian Dumoulin, and a Ethan Bear. So, three young guns so far, and practically three no names. So, Hopefully, maybe like a Dazzler and get like a rookie or something. Oh, nice. There we go. It did not open how I wanted it, but we move. Got a Sean Monahan, Milan Lucic, Evgeny Kuznetsov, Igor Zamula, and a Oliver Ekman Larson Dazzler Screen. A Dante Fabro. Marcus Pedersen, and a Roop. It's not bad for me in fantasy. He didn't help me get to a finals, but everybody had kind of stacked teams for finals, so I didn't have a great team. Grabbed a bunch of the rookies that didn't pan out. So, just trying to make my money back for this year, so. Got a Warren Fogle. A Darren Helm, a Sam Steele, Arturi Lepinen, and another canvas of P.K. Subban. I'm assuming that's going to be our last canvas. Vladimir Tarasenko, Sam Reinhardt, Josh, and Josh Bailey. Oh, move my camera slightly, trying to move you guys right back. And moving on to our 3, 6, 9, 12, 14th pack. I like these, these are easy to open. Easy to open, maybe not to get out, but they're easy to. Oh my, I keep knocking, knocking my camera about, but. Yeah, hey, Ryan Reeves, the only person to, let's say, match up against Tom Wilson after playing the Rangers. Kyle Connor, Jacob Verana, and a, hey, oh, nice. A Josh Norris, rookie materials. That was one of the. <laughs> One of the cards I was not expecting to get. I didn't feel very, very much thicker. But Josh Norris, very nice. It's a good name. Good name to have for um, Josh Nor or Josh Norris. Got a Paul Byron and a Victor Mete. Uh, let me see. Let's see. Look at the odds of getting a rookie materials in one of these packs. So, try to flip this out. Uh, young guns, nope. Not what we're looking for. Gonna fold this thing down. Rookie materials is one in fifty-five, so practically one in every two of these. I get a rookie materials. So happy I got one of them. Let's shoot for these dual rookie materials. <laughs> it's like, oh, like two hundred chance, one in two hundred. Sure, which what we got in this pack. Let's open this wide open. Oh, just up over there. We got Brett Connolly, Alexander Nylander. His like, name barely fits in the border there. Nick Schmaltz, Logan Couture, and the award winners of Connor Hellbuck, AJ Garner, Kenzie Weger, another player who helped me get into the playoffs for um. My fantasy league and a Ryan Getzlaff. I heard he's. I think I don't think he's demanded a trade, but I think everybody's looking. Or I think he's looking to get traded. I'm pretty sure. We're on our sixteenth card. I'm pretty sure. Sixteenth, not sixteenth card. We've been way past our sixteenth card. Well, we're on to our sixteenth pack. We got a Adam Henrique, 
Henry Yokiaraju, Jack Hughes, blew up now that 2019 I think series, series 1 is like blowing up now, I think Brian Russ, we got a Andrew Monashiapani, Roman Yossi, a Zemgis Jurgensen, oh, we've got a, actually this is like the top, we got a, ah, oh, doesn't look like a big name, Rangers, Brandon Crawley, so not a, not a great name either, nine, nine games for the Hartford, Hartford Whalers, almost had the same amount of penalty minutes, so probably won't make the NHL roster, but what? I think that's four young guns down, four or five. And then getting like two or so more. So got a carry price. Brad Marchand, Anton Strawman, and we got a Dazzler, Green Dazzler, of a Mark Shifley, Richard Panic, Max Patch Ready, Cam Atkinson, and a Ryan Hartman. I think that's it for Dazzlers. This is the next pack. We've got a Anton Kudobin, Andrei Sveshnikov, a Warren Fogel, and a UD Portraits of Yanni Hakampa. So, I prefer to have a Portraits of Yanni Hakampa instead of one of my young guns because. His young gun is practically nothing, so Ilya Mikheyev, Brian Dumoulin, Ethan Bear, and, oh, and a now healthy Vladimir Tarasenko. Well, I'm pretty sure he's healthy. I do not know. That guy's like on the IR and then back off the IR. But. A Oscar Sungfist, Tyler Boza. A Ben Hutton and a young gun. Ryan Graves, another person <laughs> that came in the or in, in fantasy. Andre Gorkovsky, Rasmus Anderson, Zdeno Chara, and our and then let's see what team he's Pittsburgh it seems. Yeah, Pittsburgh, hopefully it what's his name? Uh, the defenseman. What's Anthony Angela. Not quite the Pittsburgh Penguin I was hoping for, but I think that's five, five or six, so doesn't look good for young guns. Let's rip this open. I was hoping for that cap all, but there's very low chance. A Darren Helm, Cam Steele, Arturi Lekin, a Choke. Joel Kivrianta, marquee rookie, a Sam Reinhardt, Josh Bailey, Jake Garner, and Mackenzie Weger. So we're seeing a lot of duplicates now, even though technically we wouldn't, shouldn't have any duplicates, but technically since this is retail, we're going to get loads of duplicates. So, I was thinking of buying a hobby, but I thought since this was a lot cheaper when I bought it, I was just going to buy one of these. So, Jeremy McCann, Jonas Brodeen, Alex Chason, Travis Dermott, and this is the defenseman I was looking for, Pierre Oliver Joseph, but got him in the UD portraits. We got a Brendan Lemieux, Brent Burns, and a Mario Ferrero. Down to our last three cards. Looks like we got our last Dazzler in here. We got a Brett Conley, Alexander Nylander, Nick Schmaltz, we got a Alex Kalorn, UD Canvas, and we've got our green Bowen Byram. There we go. A rookie Dazzler. I wish it was a higher number Dazzler, or higher, I guess higher tier, I guess you could classify, higher tier Dazzler, but Dazzler nonetheless. Ryan Getzlaff, Richard Panic, and Max Pacioretty. Let's look for 
Sort of green dazzler. Dazzler rookie green is one in seven. But I don't see where the normal dazzlers are. Mm. Yeah, I don't see any of the regular dazzlers. But as you can see right like right here, it's a one in seven chance of getting a rookie dazzler. It's actually I looked through the rookie duel materials, it's one in five hundred and seventy six packs. Um no don't wanna do the math because that's a lot of um packs to have to open up to even get a chance at a dual materials. Maybe you have to do like a, a case case break or whatever. Which however cost however much that costs like twelve hundred dollars or something. Probably. So allow them to our last two packs. My name Ian Cole, Nate Brandon Smith, uh, Anthony Sorelli, a Victor Olofsson, and a Jake Oatanger. Oatanger? I can't remember. I can't tell. But I think blue parallel too. It's not bad. Um, he's played a pretty good, decent season for the Dallas Stars. Uh, Valtteri Filippo, Jake Bertanen, and a Mark Giordano. So, we've got our final pack of the video. Put some pack magic on Johnny T here. And not expecting anything good out of this pack since we got practically all our dazzlers and everything like that. So, got it. Logan Couture, Carey Price, Brian Mark. Oh, never mind. We've got another young gun. So, Dominic Kubalik. Vince Dunn, Ryan Hartman, Cam Atkinson, and Brad on the front. Goaltender. Hopefully this is Ilya Sorokin. Oilers. That's not great news. Stuart Skinner. Yeah, not not great. 892 save percentage with a 3.31. Goals against. Not a great last young gun, but let me grab all the inserts from every pack and and do a little recap. Okay, I'm back with all our inserts. So we're guaranteed one award winner in our box. We got a Alec Regula, or I should probably say Connor Hellebuck award winner. We got a Alec. Regula, Kirill Ustamenko, we got a Gilly Sen, Joel Kivranta, Igor Zamula, Stuart Skinner, and a Orton Barham. For JD Portraits, we got Yanni Hakampa, oh, Pierre Oliver Joseph, Orton Barham, Philip Kurashev. For the canvas, we got a Alex Kalorn. Ox I follow, PK Subban, and a Jamie Ben for the Dazzlers. Got a Mark Shifley, a rookie of Bowen Byram, and a Oliver Larson, and then a Zach Breezy. And this was, I think, 1 in 30, 30 packs, so of a Jake Ovatanger. And now to the disappointing young uh, Stuart Skinner, Anthony Angelo, Brandon Crowley. Matthias Brom, Austin Bogonski, and Matthias Kavlenix is probably the highest odds out of all of these young guns that we got. To finish off, we've got a Josh Norris working materials, and there's like a 1 in 55 chance of getting it. So, not even in um, two, two of these um, retail boxes you're supposed to get them. So, I say that's this is the win of the box. He's also a nice and bigger rookie name. Not the best, but 100% Josh Doris is one of the better names to get for a rookie materials. Thank you guys very much for watching.
please leave a like and subscribe and comment down below which young gun you believe will actually have the best odds of actually making it pro. My odds are on Matthias Kaplenix, but what do you guys think? Thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see you guys at the next video.